Aquarius, and welcome to your career and money reading for April 2021. This is for the Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign of Aquarius. It is, of course, a collective reading, so take what resonates, leave what doesn't. You guys know the drill by now. Be sure to check your other signs for any additional messages that may be coming through for you. If you guys like my content, please like, share, hit that subscribe button, guys. I appreciate it. Let's continue to grow. So thank you very, very, very much. If you're new to my channel, hi, how are you? It's good to meet you. And if you're returning, hello, welcome back. It is so great to see you again. As always, if you want to book a personal reading with me, you can, of course, do so on the website. I'll link below. The website has changed, you guys. Do note that. Feel free to peruse. See all the changes. Would love to hear your feedback. And at the time of filming, I have a $10 off tarot and uh, psychic services uh, coupon going on until the 6th of April, so be sure to check that out. All right, you guys, my lunar brothers and sisters, let's get into April's career and money for Aquarius. What do we need to know? There we go. That feels right. All right. Page of Cups. Knight of Swords. Judgments. King of Cups. Interesting. Okay. Right. surprise information coming in about something yeah there's shakeups I don't know why they're they're using the word shakeup like movement and offers coming in like seemingly out of the blue here You're being, what's the right word I'm looking for? You're being called to level up, Aquarius. But that requires a certain amount of continuity on your part. Um, watch your emotions this month. They're saying be a bit more level-headed, grounded, balanced, okay? Yeah, see, in control here with the Emperor. Some of you might get a promotion. Some of you just need to stand in your power more. Regardless of what comes in, it's imperative that you don't get in your head about it and don't worry okay don't keep yourself tied to old beliefs about how a certain like how things are supposed to fall into place because you have two knights here right that's movement coming in things coming in we have passion we have communication and we have the ten of pentacles like money looks good aquarius but it's not going to come in that expected way, right? It's, it's coming not quite the way you expect, right? Things are going to go your way here with justice. You just need to, again, that... Hmm, I feel like it's going to be a challenge for you to step up and stand in your power this month. Right? Remember to keep balanced here. You don't want to swing the pendulum into like personal power, but then being an asshole, right? You still want to kind of keep a little bit of your dream like dream like qualities. People are coming to you for a reason. And offerings for a reason. 
So don't worry about it. Yeah, see? Y charismatic. You're being, dr like, people are drawn to you. It's like you're very, very much yourself and it intrigues people. So if it comes out of, like, if these offers or this money comes in an, an unorthodox way. Holy fuck, Aquarius, don't look a gift horse in the mouth. Don't fight it. Don't get up in your head and be like, oh, that's a lot of responsibility. Oh, I don't know. Ah, and back out. Because you have the potential of being very, very happy and satisfied with this new opportunity that you are given. You're being, you're being given a gift. Okay. Meanwhile, you're super creative. It's like, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, you're kind of like you're a very loving person so people are drawn to you you're very much yourself you're very creative you're very you almost have this little bit of mystique about you right it's like you're a dreamer and people like that and you do your own thing and you're like well it's what i want to do fuck it right so keep that going and follow that creativity follow where that leads don't be worried about the leadership stuff, okay? Because you won't actually have to try very hard. Follow your intuition, just keep being you, right? Just keep being that authentic version of you. And let the offers roll in. What's coming in here is that some of you, it's like messages come in or like you have little messengers coming and dropping hints. But again, everything is very subtle, not in your face, not asked directly right off the hop. It's like you're getting little breadcrumbs and then the offer's there. So start really paying attention. Listen to that intuition. That being said, right, we said you're being called up. If your gut says, don't do it, then don't do it. But make sure that it's truly your intuition and not just fear talking. Okay? Because we have the nine of swords here, getting caught up in the hamster wheel of our own thoughts. It's not your intuition, right? Your intuition comes from your gut. Things, yeah, see? Eight of Wands, Knight of Pentacles, things are coming in faster than you think. Okay. <laughs> well, it's kind of funny because it's, it's going to seem to you like everything's out of the blue and that it's come very, very quickly kind of in. But in actuality, with the Knight of Pentacles here, this has been a long time making its way to you and it's finally coming to you in this month. So it's not as out of the blue as it seems. But this, I cannot stress enough, Aquarius, that this is going to require you to kind of move into that kind of leadership role. Right? To kind of take charge a little bit. So don't <laughs> don't freak out about it, okay? Trust your gut. Trust that you know what you're doing. Don't fight it. Go with the flow. The universe is giving you a gift, okay? Run with it. All right. 
Thank you so much, Aquarius. Kind of interesting reading here for you. I'm kind of uh, intrigued. I'm totally excited. I'd love to hear what you think in the comments below. Thank you so much, and we will talk to you very soon. Bye.